care about me cause you're lonely Cause I'm the only one around You say you are better safe than sorry Cause you're too scared to hit the ground Might seem dark but you know that I'm honest Might look broke but you know I can solve it Do you care about me cause you're lonely Cause I'm the only one around To wrap around to forget about I don't wanna be the same thing That you left before Do it all once more I don't wanna be a blanket That you wrap around to forget about I don't wanna be the same thing That you left before Do it all once more took all of this stuff fishing, was able to catch fish on pretty much every lure in the bin except for the uh, for the top water. But uh, early on in, in fishing, this is why nothing else was recorded, um, I was using one of the lures in this box and um, yeah, it, it wasn't pretty. A lot of blood, ruined some jeans or pants, but no big deal. Um, I kept fishing, it was fun. So we did it. Uh, I apologize for any weird noise that is reverberating. Uh, we're here in my garage because all the kids are awake. I just want to get the video out because I love MTB Pro boxes. All right, so straight to the dibble. Uh, I did feel like this was a lighter box than normal. Not as many items. I'm gonna make it real quick and simple so you guys can get out and check out yours. First and foremost, we have the Lucky Craft Gunfish. The Lucky Craft Gunfish <clears throat> is this topwater walking bait. It's gonna be similar to like a spook, uh, so it's a traditional walking bait. Uh, not a huge fan of the color, the black and the yellow. Uh, not really sure where this becomes like a local thing, but uh, this is the only one I didn't get a bite on today. So really solid box. Uh, I'm sure I could get a bite on this if I went to the right body of water, but the body of water I went to, this didn't work. Walk, walking topwater bait. Kind of light, but has some rattles. Awesome piece. Next up is the Lucky John Pilot. Uh, now this is the lure that I jack my hand up with. Uh, and I actually really, really like it. It's this shallow water crankbait. Uh, really big, wide lip here, so it wobbles really well in the water. But, um, yeah, if you can see that hook, um, that, would be, that would be why my hand is jacked up. It um, didn't go well. Didn't, didn't go well. Uh, list price on, sorry, the gunfish was $15.99, Lucky Pilot, $8.99. Next up is the original swim bait uh, by, do I even have the box still? I must have gotten rid of it, huh? Oh no, there it is. By Optimum Baits. Optimum Baits, this is your swim bait. Uh, this is also listed as $8.99. I don't know that this is an $8.99 lure. You know, this is one of the few times in a mystery tackle box that I think, you know, maybe it wasn't the right dollar volume, but um, this is still a good lure. You know, at the, uh, a swim bait is always a good lure. Um, but, okay, swim bait. Next up is the, next up is the Liquid Mayhem fish attractant. So this is actually something I didn't use today because it smells like shad. There's no shad in the pond I was fishing, so I didn't want to confuse fish. Gonna use this over the next weekend though when I go over to Braidwood and keep an eye out for that video. I'm gonna dissect Braidwood for you. It's gonna be super fun. Listed at $4.99. Next up is the Vile Crawl 
by Biospawn. Uh, I actually got a lot of bites on this today. This was a fun little uh, little lure. Now, here it is, boom, looks like a craw. These obviously you pull apart, it gives a little bit more action. What I really like about this is there's this groove right here. Let's kind of get zoomed in on this here. Now this groove inside of here is where you put your hook. So for your offset hook, you put it right in there. Awesome, awesome little spot there. Um, really good plastic didn't get jacked up like a lot of the plastics i buy so from this is incredible um after actually using it i have to give this a two thumbs up uh, and it is listed for 3.59 i would take a case of those thanks uh in all colors just all colors and last but not least we have the lunker city sluggo uh and this is 260 Something I never would have fished. Uh, I was out fishing with my dad, and he was throwing just a Senko worm around, and it was the only one that we had, and he caught a bunch of fish on it. And he said, you know what, screw it, I'll just throw out the Sluggo. Uh, it's got a little joint here in the middle, and it's got actually a great action. He rigged this up like it was a trick worm. Um, so, you know, weightless, just a traditional hook. Uh, if he had a smaller hook, it would have been even better, but we only had a, uh, a three-aught, and it kind of messed with the action a little bit. But wow, dude, he was getting hit on this constantly working it like a trick worm. So weightless hook, cast it out there, real slow pop, real, you know, just got, gain it in a little pop here and there. They loved this thing. I would have never thrown this in a million years. And because of him and because of this box, we were able to catch fish today on it. Um, I have to say, I feel like this box is a little light in comparison to past boxes. Um, they, the way that the hard plastics are dialed in, or the hard hard baits are dialed in, is uh, they're more expensive products. So you're trying to get a better bang for your buck. You know what I mean? They're they're putting in higher quality items and less quantity, um, which I don't disagree with. That's a good idea to do from time to time. Uh, but you do also like getting a lot of baits in a box, so there is a give and a take. And you know, only having six in a box, but still for the $24, you can't really complain. Um, so overall, great, great box. Uh, again, I just do feel like it was a little light, uh, and it jacked up my finger horribly bad. Now, if you've been paying attention to this video, you know that I'm in a new location. Uh, I'm in my garage. But why isn't my car in this spot? I'll see you guys here real soon for another video explaining just what that might be. Uh, but in the meantime, I'm gonna give you a little glimpse of why. All right, that's it. That's all the glimpse you get. That was probably too much of a glimpse. That's all you're getting. Guys, thank you so much for watching this episode. If you liked it, if you like continue watching me do these unboxings, please hit like, comment, subscribe to the video. Until next time, guys, happy foozing. I got a boat. <laughs>